In this topic, we will cover graphing a function of the form f of x equals ax plus b with fractional slope. So, um, if this is a whole number, then it's pretty easy, or an integer, a whole integer, it's pretty easy to graph things um, using your slope. You have to remember what the slope represents. Slope represents the change in the y over the change in the x. Another way you might see it being represented is the rise over the run. Okay. Now I always tell people that if your slope is positive, then both numbers can be positive. If your slope is negative, always choose to make the top negative and the bottom positive. Okay. Whereas if it's a positive fraction, then both are positive. This means that you will always run to the right, always run forward. However, when it comes to the rise, if it's positive, you actually go up, and if it's negative, you'll go down. But always go to the right, okay? So in this case, our slope is four over three. And if you begin with your y-intercept, so we're used to seeing things in this form, right? mx plus b. B is your y-intercept. B stands for begin. That's where you're going to begin. So I'm going to begin with my um, my y-intercept of positive 1. And then m is going to be the way I move to get to the next point. So since it's 4 over 3, that means I'm going to go up because it's positive and to the right always. So I'm going to go up one, two, three, four units and then I'm going to go to the right one, two, three units. And this is where my second point will be. And then I can draw a line through the two points to get the graph of the line. And that is how you draw a graph using the slope. Now, just as an example, had it been negative 4 thirds x plus 1, I still would have started off at my y-intercept of 1, but because it's negative 4, I would have gone down 4 and then to the right. So 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 1, 2, 3 to the right giving me a line that would have gone in this direction. Okay, so just remember, if it's positive, you're going to go up and to the right. If it's a negative number, you're going to go down and to the right, but always to the right. The way I remember is you run forward, you don't run backward, or you'll trip and fall, right? So always run forward to the right, and then the negative will just tell you whether you're going up or down.